today I want to show you how to how I make my venturis. This time I'm going to be using a one inch uh, inlet and a three quarter inch on this T right here. Um, but you'll need a T. You want to have a smaller uh, T portion than where the water pumps through. Okay, this is how I'm going to connect it to my system. You may need to use a threaded fastener or whatever, um, but that goes in there. And then this will go in here. And then this will come from the pump. This will shoot out the water in the air. And then the air will come from here. So you want, I'm going to use, I will end, use some 90s to get around some things that I need to. But uh, this is where the air comes in. This is where the water comes. And then the water and air shoots out here. Okay. So first thing we need to do is we need to cut this at 45. Uh, roughly 45. It's... I like to use an angle iron or a, um, an angle, what do you, an angle grinder with a cutoff disc on it. An angle, angle iron. Uh, okay, so I'm putting on my PPE right now. I'm gonna stretch the cord out, and I'm just gonna zip this sucker off like that. See, I got it. All right. Take it off my PPE. Okay, so now we got this guy, and that needs to set down in that hole. So if I put it in there, it's not going to reach. And the reason why these things have that lip, there's a lip in there. The lip, I need to take that lip off. And for whatever reason, I cannot find my one inch auger bit. So I'm going to try a three-quarter inch auger bit right now. And if it doesn't work, I'm figure something out. Okay, so make sure, make sure that that point doesn't puncture the bottom of the, of the pipe there. So I'm just going to kind of wallow this out. So when you put it in, you want to make sure that, that this part is where the water comes from and then the air will leave that way. So you want to put it in, uh, if you had threaded fittings on this side, you want to make sh that go to your pump. You want to make sure that, that this sharp angle is on that side of it, wherever you're, wherever it comes from the pump. And then there, there you have it. It's in. You want just that little bit of a gap down there. And like I said, if you did it right and you can pull, slide this pipe in and out a little bit, you can play with it and just visually see how much air bubbles is coming out. But so how this works essentially is as water passes through here, underneath that low that low ridge it create it turns the um the water into like a low pressure high velocity uh stream and it shoots the water out of there and as it does that it creates a vacuum through there creates low pressure in there and then so it's it sucks air in through the inlet and then it shoots it out i love this because it circul recirculates everything with just one pump and I don't have an air pump that I have to worry about, just a, a circulating pump. And that also um, acts as my aerator too. But that's, that's really it. 
there's nothing else to do to this except for um, glue this guy in, put it in. So there it is. There's my Venturi. Let's go see it in action. I love these things.